Hello YouTubers, this is my electric bicycle. This is a 20 inch folding bicycle from China. The brand name is Caddy Up. And attached to this bicycle I have this 350 watt, 24 volt electric motor. You can see that it's bolted onto the rear rack. To keep the whole rear rack from swaying from side to side I added these aluminum uh, supports right here. Attached to the motor itself I have a homemade drive roller. I made this from a BMX bike peg that I cut to length and then I JB welded this one and one quarter inch PVC pipe around it. The overall diameter of this drive wheel is 2.125 inches. The back tire is 20 inches. So as the motor spins, it reduces it and makes contact with the back wheel, giving an overall gear ratio of 9.4 to 1. It's a pretty good compromise between speed and torque. I have a 350 watt, 24 volt controller, as well as two 12 amp, 12 volt batteries. This is from a Scoot and Go scooter I got online. They're used, so the range is about six miles. I get 40 minutes of use. Eventually, I'm going to upgrade the batteries, but for right now, they do the job. I have a wireless speedometer to keep track of the speed, and I did have a throttle on here from that scooter that I got on Craigslist. However, it died on me, so now I have a simple on-off switch. It's still connected to the controller to make sure the motor doesn't get too many volts or doesn't overheat. Right, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go for a little test drive so you can see how this system works. I've got a flat trail here. I'm going to pedal to get it started and I flip the switch. On comes the electric motor right now. And now we're up to full speed. Top speed in this bicycle is about 20 miles per hour. Right now we're cruising at about 16 miles per hour, which is normal cruising speed. You can see that I'm not pedaling. All in electric power. You can also tell how quiet the electric motor is as well. If there's some slight upgrades, it'll probably slow down to about 12, 14 miles per hour. And if you have anything really steep, you do have to help it. As it's really made more for an assist than, uh, than something that can go over anything. Still cruising at about 16 miles per hour right now. Not pedaling. These batteries are lead acid. They do weigh 18 pounds. The whole bicycle weighs about 59 pounds. So again, the batteries aren't the best because it does add some weight to it, but for right now they work pretty well and also economical. Going 15 miles per hour right now. No pedaling. And reaching the end of the trail, so I'll turn off the electric motor, or slowing down. And this is the end of the video. Thank you for watching.